Hello, this is Mr. Neil Reiterter, consultant audiologist and director of ClearWax. Thank you for joining me in another demonstration video of our recently developed wax scope, which will be available to purchase early autumn of this year, so 2022. And if you are interested, please do express your interest by emailing info at clearwax.co.uk. So it's just a couple of quick, very quick videos. Um, and this is patient one, and they've got very dark earwax. It was more lateral, this earwax, so near the entrance. And you can see that we're just using our 4.25 millimeter speculum. They come in three sizes, with, sorry, four sizes. We've got a smaller size of 3.5 mil. And this is the 4.25, I believe. And then we've got the five and the 5.75. And just mopping up near the entrance, we're on the cartilaginous portion here. And you can just see the clarity of the dissolving the suction probe. It's in focus and um, you should be very confident in its um, manipulation as a result so you, because you've got full view and um, focus of it so you, it gives you more uh, confidence and control and manipulation and precision when you're working near the canal uh, wall so I'm just using this little dabbing technique here just to get some of this softer wax out and just going to stretch this you can see the ear is quite narrow the entrance I'm just going to insert Speculum, I'm going to dilate the ear canal. You can see we've got a lovely view of the eardrum there. You've got a good light reflex. You'll have another view in a moment. We can actually see the blood vessels on the uh, malleus, handle of malleus. Because I'm on the cartilaginous portion, I just thought I'd mop up this syrupy, sticky wax. I do wear a hearing aid, so just a bit cautious that it will it might block the sand ball or the wax filter. So I just got the eardrum back in focus. You can see just that lovely view. And this is patient two, and I think this is off the patient's left ear. See, it's slightly uh, paler in appearance. Uh, this has got more keratin, more dead skin. And the skin has formed into a plug alongside some wax, and it's attached itself to the canal wall. So you can see, um, using this uh, little wriggle motions here, just to help detach the, the wax and skin plug from the canal wall. And this, this ear canal is completely occluding, so from the entrance all the way to the patient's eardrum. Once again, you can see the clarity, the view that we've got here. We know exactly where uh, the, the suction probe is. It doesn't look distorted. It's coming from a higher angle of incidence, which means that the suction probe is not in direct line of the magnifying lens, which can cause distortion because you're seeing the back part of the, of the zone of suction probe. So I'm just trying to tease this out. So it's still got a bit more. This is more on the roof of the ear canal. So I'm just in, and there's quite a few hairs there as well. Again, just using this the 4.25 speculum. I think um, the 4.25 is probably going to be the most commonly used. Um, truth be told, uh, I actually kind of prefer the 3.5 in, in some sense because I'm able to get any inside any ear without much difficulty and. Because of the design of our speculum, we've got a, a slit um, which is used to insert the instrument into the ear. Um, doesn't actually matter in some respect what speculum size we use because I've still got free reign of the instrument regardless. So again, just going to dilate the ear canal. A nice patient, you can see the eardrum there. They've got quite a bendy ear canal and you can see the anterior canal wall, which is um, kind of masking the anterior portion of the ear eardrum we can just just had it in view a moment ago so i've just gone to the back part of the ear canal wall, wall now it's more po uh, more lateral so the uh, lateral posterior canal wall just peeling some dead skin off there it came quite easily and there's just a speck of dread skin that got trapped in the entrance so we're happy with that so um if you are interested in the clear wax wax scope and you want to know more and be added to our mailing list, please email info at clearwax.co.uk. Thank you. Bye.